I'm at 10K in one day, a couple days ago, working off of this dresser. That's it. I don't have a desk. I should have one right here. I don't. I don't have anything set up. We're in a really awful apartment in not a great area. Uh, for, for context though, myself and my roommate Jack, we both run marketing agencies and we're essentially enjoying the financial and time freedom that comes along with running agencies doing multi, multi, multi six figures a year. And with that, moving from city to city. So essentially what we're doing is we're starting here in San Diego and then we're going to Arizona and then we're going to Miami and then wherever else we wanna go. But starting here in San Diego for two months and to be very honest with you that we did not mean to do this with ourselves. We did not have to stay in a place where this is my desk and where, let me show you my view. My view is like a gas station and a McDonald's and a mobile repair store. We didn't have to do that to ourselves. The Airbnb listing looked nicer and we're just gonna bug it. We're, we're, we're calling this agency trap house V1 for, you know, for lack of a better term, kind of a funny name for the crib. But while we are here, I wanted to make this video for you guys for two reasons. Reason one, I wanna be the first person to make a video talking about making 10K in a single day without trying to flex on you. And reason two, um, this is the first time I've changed my environment to this extent, living with a new type of person in a new city, in a new environment that I've never been in before. And it's completely changed my life in the first week since I have been here. I'll lean against my, my spare mattress here while I talk. Uh, I'll give you guys a tour at the end of the place as well. First thing, making 10K in a day from this setup. It sounds like a lot of money, and it is, but it's very, very possible. Um, around a year ago in September was my first time ever making 10K in a month. And now I did it in a day, not even in new cash. It's not like I closed people on some PIFs or closed a bunch of clients that day. I just had people, my clients, who were making more money than they were paying me and they all chose to renew that month. My recurring is really great in my agency. And they just all paid on, on the same day as they do every month. And it's just gotten to the point where every day, every month from now on, that day is gonna be a 10K day, which is amazing. I don't have to do a lot of work. The agency model starting to work for me and money's coming in, which is really, really, awesome and it doesn't need to be a crazy thing like when i first started i thought it had to be like this amazing setup you had to have like the the guru lighting with the blue light and then the red light behind you and some crazy setup with like a side camera and like all of these things and you don't like you just need your ability to have a camera right here this is like what i see on zoom calls and have prospects still trust you when you're on the phone with them I just tell them it's a standing desk in my new office. And those are both technically true. I treat this as my office and I'm standing while I'm working. Um, and they know that I'm making a lot of money because I'm making them a lot of money and they know a lot of people are paying me, so it doesn't matter. But when I first started, I thought I needed some crazy setup. I thought I needed all these things to make the money, but you don't. As long as you just become the person who's worthy of the money, regardless of your surroundings, you're gonna make a lot. However, going into point two of the video, Changing your environment to something super, super beneficial makes it a lot easier to make money. On the first day of being here, which was last Monday, so around a week ago, I made 10K in a day. And throughout the rest of that first week of being here, I made 20, between 26 and $28,000. I'm not completely sure, which, which sounds insane, right? I'm not gonna talk about my full monthly revenue because it's just revenue, it's not profit. Um, but $27,000 in a week and it was easy. It was easy because I did a lot of work and a lot of work was easy because there were no distractions. I'll show you in a second, but we have a TV in the house that neither Jack and I have not turned it on once since we moved in here. 
at all. I don't have a TV in my room. I go to bed here every day at the same time. I wake up every day at the same time. I'll show you our fridge. There's nothing in it. We have the same thing to eat every day. We have grilled chicken, avocados, green salsa, and then I, I have eggs as well. And that's pretty much our entire diet. It's very clean, we're eating very well, makes it very easy to think we're sleeping enough, and the environment just lends itself really well to work. When I was in other places, for example, when my family had access to me while I was working, they would wanna talk sometimes, my friends would call me, they'd wanna do things, because they didn't really understand that I was working. And also my old environment with any vices that I had um, or that you have when you move, they don't remind you. So Jack and I have a whiteboard in the living room with everything that we don't wanna do every day when we're here and when we do wanna hear. And if we accomplish all of those, we draw a line. And because we're both competitive people, we're both young people making a lot of money, we can't lose. So we have to keep the promise to ourselves to do everything we told us ourselves that we were gonna do that day in order to move on to the next day, which has been very, very helpful. So that's pretty much it. One, you can make a lot as long as you're the person who you need to be with, with any setup. You don't need to brag. You don't need to like feel like you're better than other people as long as your prospects respect you, as long as the people around you respect you. Because um, even you guys, like I can make a video like this. I'm not flexing, but you guys know how much I make. So it doesn't matter if I'm living in a shitty apartment, right? And two, like if you're able to change your environment, I know it's expensive. I know this shitty apartment in San Diego is 3,500 bucks a month, which you might not have. But if you're able to just get out of where you are, if it's like not motivating you, because this place is motivating me to get out of here, I'll, I'll tell you that. Um, you're going to make more money just because if you put yourself in the right environment, you're going to make a lot more. So let, let me let me give you guys the, the house tour now. Speaking of, of said environment, right? So we're going outside. We got Jack's dog right there. Interesting dog. Uh, it's really sad when we leave. We got Jack's room right there with his whiteboard at the bottom. And then let me guys give you a, a crib tour. So I don't, I don't even know if we have lights, to be honest. Uh, there we go, cool. So this is the main living room. We got some of these gay little lights right there that Jack brought. Um, this is where Jack works every day. He doesn't have a desk. And again, multi, 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 six figures a year in personal take-home profit doesn't have a desk works right there there's no myths you don't need a crazy setup you just need to be good at your job second thing tv tv has not been turned on since we got here we don't really do stuff like this and this is like the the little whiteboard i was talking about with like the lines of like us not you know doing certain things uh during the day um kitchen where we cook all the time and then the fridge with nothing in it. There's no junk food in there. It's just chicken, blueberries, water, uh, salsa, and eggs. And that's it. There's, it's so hard to be unhealthy here. It's so hard to be distracted here. And as a result of that, we work a lot. And then in the off time when we're not working, we'll like go to a nice restaurant or a really bad restaurant. Or we went to this like cold plunge event on, on Sunday, which was interesting. Um, but just being in this environment, I wanted to show you guys, I wanted to show you guys the Airbnb. I'm going to be making more videos. Jack, say what's up. That's Jack. And that's it for this video. I'm going to make more videos like documenting the agency trap house journey, us like traveling around doing what we're doing. And I'm working on a free course for you guys that I was going to post here, but it looked kind of ugly on the channel. So I'm just going to like link it as soon as I'm done with it. Um, if you want to follow me, I'll put it on my Instagram when it's done. Uh, DM me at Wi-Fi Levi. I also have a free Discord as well. Um, DM me there. And that's it for this video. Probably not going to be too many of it. It's probably just going to upload it. And I will see you soon. Peace.